Hi and welcome to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to subscribe and follow me on Instagram for more interesting tips and tutorials. And don't forget to smash that bell button not to skip my new tutorials. Hi and welcome back to my channel. Today we will create small tassel earrings made of seed beads and crystals in the ends. Let's begin. For this project you will need one color of seed beads I have in uh, silver some crystals in size 2 mm, I have as well in silver, then thread, needle, eye pins, scissors, cutters and round nose pliers, stud and glue. You can use even super glue. To decorate our top part here, I have a Swarovski crystal 4 mm, it's very shiny and nice, I really love to include Swarovski elements in my handmade jewelry because it gives that extra sparkle and shine and rich look to any jewelry you create. Take one and a half meter of the thread. We will start with our strands. Take eye pin, go inside the eye pin and make a knot. And one more. Then take a glue and put a bit of the glue on our knot. Then take seed beads. I have Czech seed beads in size 10. Every strand of our earring contains of 26 seed beads and 3 crystals in the end. We start with 26 seed beads. When you have 26 seed beads, then we start with crystals. You take one crystal, one seed bead, one crystal, one seed bead, one crystal and one seed bead. And you enter to the seed beads all the way up. Don't pull too hard because our strand should be flexible. Check it. It's okay. So now enter to the eye pin. and inside the thread loop here to secure our first strand. Let's start our second strand. Take 26 seed beads. Then one crystal one seed bead, one crystal, one seed bead, one crystal and one seed bead and you enter to the seed beads this way and then we create a knot on our eye pin for it you enter to our eye pin with the needle and then you enter to the thread loop Now we have two strands ready. Let's start third one. Take 26 seed beads. Now take one crystal, one seed bead, one crystal, one seed bead, and one crystal, and one seed bead. And enter to the seed beads. Then enter to the our eye pin. You even can enter to the thread here as well. And to the thread loop. Now we have our three strands ready. To create earring, you will need nine strands, all the same, 26 seed beads. One crystal, one seed bead, one crystal, one seed bead, one crystal and one seed bead. And again, all the way up, 
through the all seed beads. Continue the same while you will have 9 strands ready. We are about to finish our strands. We will create now last one. We secure our thread. We do the same knot as we did before. One more time. And then you create knot from two threads. One which was left from the beginning and other our working thread. Make a knot. One knot. And two knots. Then put a bit of the glue to secure it and cut our threads. Our strands are ready. Now take our flower cap. I have shape of crown and diameter is 10 millimeters. Enter with our eye pin in the crown. Then add Swarovski crystal or any crystal or pearl you have. Take round nose pliers, bend our pin, then take cutters, leave around one centimeter, cut it, and then with the help of round nose pliers you need to bend our pin then take hook or stud what you have and attach it to our earring and close the pin and our earrings are ready those are very small and elegant, you can wear them even every day or in the evening to go to the restaurant because this uh, beautiful small crystals and here Swarovski crystal will shine and you will be more attractive and beautiful as well as you can create the pair of earrings for someone you love and I'm sure they will really really like this creation. Using this technique, what you just learned, you can create something uh, like this, very elegant long earrings. Here I have used as well seed beads size 10, but in the end I used only just one crystal and one small seed bead. But all technique is the same. You can create something like this, created only with the crystals. I will leave a link to this tutorial here and in the description so you can learn how to create crystal tassel earrings here i just have a flower cap bigger this diameter is 13 millimeters and but crystals are two millimeters there is a bit different technique uh, how you need to uh, take uh, beads because here from the beginning there is a seed beads and then you add crystals in the end of each strand there is a small seed bead holding our strands on their places I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like this video and comment below if you have any suggestions to my channel or any questions about this tutorial. Thank you for watching this video and have a great day!